So the FBI has confirmed that uh, Sol Paez has been found dead at the base of Mount Evans. We know she flew in from Florida to Denver Monday night. She bought a shotgun in Littleton. She was last seen in the foothills. There has been a statewide search going on for her. We have crews at the base of Mount Evans, and they're going to continue to, f to follow this and bring you updates throughout Tony, we have Tony Kovaleski on the phone right now. Tony, what can you tell us? Molly, hearing from multiple well-placed law enforcement source that the 18-year-old from Florida that they've been looking for now relentlessly for more than 24 hours is dead. Uh, the information still coming in uh, about the possible cause, but uh, there was word in the Mount Evans area, a campsite. Uh, law enforcement was moving in quickly. Uh, it's just been unfolding within about the last hour, still trying to gain more information, but we are hearing from confirmed sources that the 18-year-old is dead. Tony, and we are just getting word from the FBI that they are also uh, tweeting, confirming that she has been found dead. Do you have any more information for us? Well, we, we know that it's very active and very fluid. Um, FBI has been looking since last night. We talked to them specifically about how they were going to try to locate her. We asked questions about her cell phone. Um, the campsite does make sense because we, we were trying to figure out either she had help in the area and was staying with somebody or a campsite would be a possibility. So clearly law enforcement has been looking throughout the night, and, and this information that's breaking just within the last hour explains a lot of what's been happening. Law enforcement saying all morning long they needed help from the public. There's been some social media posting. Um, obviously, a lot of questions still to be answered. Um, some some reports questioning of the cause of death and, and looking into that, and we are still trying to confirm the exact cause of death. So uh, a lot of questions. I, uh, my phone has been blowing up, and I want to get back to... Uh, to some texts that I've been working with different sources, but right now we can confirm the 18-year-old Sol Pais from Miami came to, Cal came to Colorado yesterday, has been found dead, law enforcement there, and we expect to hear more within the next half hour. All right, and the FBI just tweeting that there is no longer a threat to the community. Obviously, there is a huge relief across the state as people, students and parents have been high alert on high alert throughout the morning. We want to get back out to, uh, to Nicole Brady. She's at the Jeffco Sheriff's Office. And Nicole, what are you learning out there? Well, it's just mostly a huge relief, obviously, Molly, as you said, a lot of law enforcement sources tweeting right now that uh, they're thankful there's no longer a danger to the community right now uh, because so many of those metro area schools made that decision to shut down today. Not just schools, daycares, private daycares, gyms, camps, other, other places where people take children all decided to close today out of an abundance of caution because uh, there were fears and uh, credible fears that someone might try to harm children today. And of course now uh, a lot of people breathing a sigh of relief that uh, this woman is off the streets. As Tony said, uh, we are hearing reports that she is dead, uh, found there at the base of Mount Evans. And we are still working to learn more from local law enforcement here as well as the FBI Denver office uh, to find out more of the circumstances that led up to this. But just just a, a huge relief and we would expect that uh, schools will be able to resume their normal activities but uh, we will keep you posted on that uh, obviously with this being the week of the Columbine anniversary that raised uh, the anxiety level among law enforcement all week and and we hope that that things will be able to return to normal but we will absolutely keep you posted if any schools decide to uh, change any plans for the rest of the week here so we'll go ahead and send this back to you and uh, bring you another live report at 11 with any of the new information we learn. Molly.